Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from mysocialu.com and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, we're gonna talk about how to use Facebook's Creator Studio to manage multiple Instagram accounts. Before we jump into the video, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit that bell icon, and also like this video. All right, now let's jump into this. So not many people know, but Facebook has this tool called Creator Studio. It's totally free, it's by Facebook. You can use it to manage not just multiple Facebook business pages, but also multiple Instagram accounts. Uh, so if you are an agency or maybe a consultant and you, uh, you work with uh, different clients and you wanna manage their Instagram accounts without using any paid tool, this is a really good option. So let me show you how to use this. So first of all, you know, if you never used the Creator Studio, just Google search Facebook Creator Studio and you're gonna see uh, something like this. So let's open this. I'm gonna open it incognito because I wanna show you what this looks like. So if this is the first time, you might see something like this. Um, this is the, the landing page and they do have sort of like two components. So Creator Studio, it has Facebook component and then uh, Instagram. Basically when you log in, you're gonna log in using your uh, Facebook account. So it will be connected, you will see all of your pages there. Now let me log into mine and show you how the inside looks like. So I'm gonna click on this and I'm already signed in. So for me, since I signed into the Creator Studio using my Facebook's personal profile, it's gonna pull all the Facebook pages. So on the Facebook side, here are all the Facebook pages that I manage, that I am an admin of, right? And then if you see, on the top, if I click on this icon Instagram, and if you're this is the first time, you may not see anything there because you need to add different accounts to your uh, creator studio by going to the Instagram. So Instagram, uh, the creator studio will detect your Facebook pages, but the Instagram accounts, you have to add them uh, one by one. So how do you do it? So we'll click on Instagram and then look on this side right here, click on Instagram accounts. And then you see how I have several different accounts uh, connected here or attached to my Creator Studio. And um, if you wanna attach it, this is the first time you're using this and you wanna add your Instagram account, you will just click on add Instagram account. And before you do that, uh, I would say just sign into uh, Instagram on your uh, browser. So what I would do is just sign into, so here I am, Ali Mirza, so I'm signed into my account, my main account, Ali Mirza 2K. By the way, if you don't follow me on uh, Instagram, you should. Uh, all right, let's go back. So make sure you sign into the Instagram in a separate tab and then come back here and click on add uh, Instagram account and then it'll uh, you know, con uh, connect to your creator studio to your Instagram. I'm not gonna do it because for me, I'm, I'm already connected. So here's my Instagram account right here. That's already connected and I have other accounts connected as well. Now, what's the benefit of using Creator Studio? The benefit is if you look here under here, create post, look at that. So you can post to Instagram feed and you can also post to IGTV using Creator Studio. So, and you can post to all of these accounts. So if I wanna say, let's say I wanna post on Instagram feed, I'll click on this and then let's select Ali Mirza, and then it's it's very straightforward. Let me resize this window. Uh, this is where I will put my caption, and if I wanna add location, I would add location here. And then I can add content. I can uh, upload from my computer, or I can also, because Instagram account is connected to a Facebook page, which is my fa business page, I social you, I can also pull in content my, from my Facebook page. So let's go actually do from uh, file upload. So when I do that, um, let me pick something to just show you guys how this is gonna look like. We are not gonna post. This is just a demo, but let's say, there you go, that's good. So here's the image. You can also do videos. And then um, you can add your hashtags here. In advanced settings, you can also turn off comments and some of the other uh, settings. But when you're ready, here's the cool thing. You can publish it right now. Or when you click on, there's a down arrow. I'm not sure if you can see this or not. But if you click on the down arrow, you're able to publish now, schedule, or save as draft. So if you work with different clients and you want to schedule their content in advance, you can do it for free. Um, so let me go back and uh, I do not want to 
this card, yes, that's fine. And if, if you noticed it, when I uh, did the to create post on Instagram feed, it gave me an option to post to any one of these accounts. So technically, I can manage and post to multiple accounts without paying for any tools. And the same is, um, let's go back, I can do Instagram feed and I can also post to IGTV, which is the videos right here. So some of these videos I have posted uh, by using this feature of Creator Studio. And it's a similar experience, so let's click on Instagram and then I'll upload my video here, then I title, uh, describe the video, and I can upload a, a custom thumbnail or I can select it, and then also I can share the preview to my feed. So it's very, the experience of uh, uploading content to IGTV, it's very similar to, obviously when you do it from the mobile device, they have some extra features there or some extra things, but it's very, very similar. Actually, it might be very uh, exactly similar. I'm not sure because um, they made uh, recent updates to their IGTV on the mobile app. But, you know, it gets the job done and you, again, you're able to publish it right now or you can also schedule this in the future. So the cool thing about the Creator Studio for on the Instagram side is, number one, you can manage multiple accounts for free. Number two, you can post to Instagram feed and also to IGTV. And then number three, you can also check insights. So if I wanna look at insights, the data on different accounts, you can. that's also available. So there are a lot of different benefits. Now, there's one thing that's missing from Facebook Creator Studio. Can you guess? Try again. Well, it's the, the posting to uh, Instagram story. So right now, they don't have that feature yet and maybe, and I'm hoping that they introduce that and add that soon in future. But if you wanna post to Instagram stories uh, from your desktop computer, from your browser, it's possible. And I use an app called, or actually a Chrome extension called Insist, which is right here. And I do have a separate uh, video and tutorial, um, the detailed demo of Insist, if you wanna, and that's an app that I use to post. And you can also use that app to manage multiple accounts and you do, it's a paid app, um, but posting, images and videos to your Instagram stories is uh, on the free plan of Insist app. So I will leave that link in the description below if you wanna check that out, if you wanna also uh, post to Instagram stories from your desktop, from your browser. Now, if you have any questions, leave those questions below in the comments. And also before you go, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. I'm gonna see you in the next one. Bye for now.